me working out in my living room in my pajamas. How cool is that? Um, anyway, I was thinking about breakfast. Most of the time that I was working out, and I, I know I have the little breakfast video playlist, but I didn't make French toast in any of those videos because I don't think I had figured it out yet how I wanted to do it. So, this is going to be in keeping with one of my breakfast meals that's less than 200 calories. So, I eat several meals, many meals a day that are low calorie, but I don't eat, I don't restrict my calories. So, definitely I have at least 1,500 a day. And that's a discussion to have with a nutritionist. I just wanted to say it because I don't want you to think that I'm one of those people that eats very low calories um, overall because that, as I understand it, is not healthy and can actually prevent weight loss if that's your goal. So, this French toast, I'm not sure, it's not unhealthy, but some of the shortcuts to make it low calorie make it less healthy. Healthy is not the right word, nutritious. So if you're making it for your children, you probably would use a different bread. I'm using a bread that's just simply low calorie, not necessarily nutritious bread. So two slices of bread. In case you're curious, it's nature's own wheat bread. Wheat, it's not whole wheat. Um, so that there's only 70 calories in both of these, 35 each which a lot of bread is 80 to 100 per slice. And that's okay. But I'm just using the bread so I can have French toast. Um, what's nutritious about it, I suppose, is my cereal bar and the fruit and the egg. So I'm gonna take that off. For my French toast batter, I've got a quarter cup of egg beaters. You can use a regular egg if you like. Um, you can add some skim milk to it. You could Keep it just egg, or you could add a splash of water. I'm adding a splash of water. Just, I just want to make sure that I have enough liquid to cover my bread. So then, a little splash, splash, dash, a dash of cinnamon and a splash of sugar-free vanilla syrup. I am so hungry. Okay. So there's your batter, and. As I'm making my French toast, I'm going to warm up my cereal bar in the microwave, and I'll be good to go. So, I'm going to stick this plate in here. Ah, where's my bread? I didn't really plan this video out. Okay. So, if you haven't made French toast before, your bread, dip in the egg batter. Voila! Fry until golden. <laughs> Flip. Do that twice. Um, and of course, I have my Walden Farms very, very extreme low calorie syrup. It's so low calorie, it says zero calorie, but don't be fooled, there's some in there. And today I have green grapes. So, grapes, cereal bar, French toast. I'm cooking it on medium high. And I will show you how lovely it looks in a moment. Um, if it sticks, just use more uh, fat spray. And really, I don't use any butter whatsoever in my French toast recipe. Ah, doesn't that look pretty? Okay, hold on. I'm going to warm up my syrup and then I'll show you the finished product there. So yes, I microwave my syrup to get a little warm. Okay, here's the breakfast. I've warmed up my syrup. Okay, like I said a minute ago, I'm starving, so I'm going to go eat this now. French toast. Deirdre's Famous Cereal Bars. You can get that recipe's online. And then any fruit that you like. <laughs> 